Hi everyone, my name is Stephanie Morell and I'm the general manager of the Bellingham Bells and I just wanted to come to you today with an update on the 2020 season. We've received quite a few inquiries about um, what does the 2020 season look like? How is the COVID-19 situation impacting the season? And I want to just kind of tell you what we know now and give you a little bit of an update. So uh, first of all, the Bells are aware of the Whatcom County Health Department's recommendation to cancel all summer events. And we are of course very respectful of that recommendation and are working closely with city officials and also with the folks at the health department to keep an eye on the situation and identify whether or not uh, summer season will be viable this summer. Um, of course, it is our entire intention to comply with any city, state, or federal mandates that are in place uh, um, as far as group gatherings. And uh, we are very respectful of the work that these groups do and uh, for their knowledge. And we, of course, will follow any recommendations that are set in place and, and we intend to do so. You know, one of the reasons why is because players, staff and fan safety are paramount. They are the most important thing. And if we cannot play in an environment that is deemed to be safe for everyone, then we're simply not going to do that. So um, as of right now, with the season six weeks away and a whole lot of summer left uh, to talk about, uh, we are cautiously optimistic that there is a possibility to play some sort of season this summer. But of course, there are lots of conversations with the city, with the folks at the health department, and the only way that that would ever be possible is if we had their blessing. And if we don't have their blessing, then um, there won't be a season. It's really just that simple, but we are cautiously optimistic and we are ready. We are tracking towards playing. We are planning and we are hoping that we can play because over the years, Joe Martin Field has been a gathering place for our community. It has been a place for affordable family fun entertainment. It has been an amazing opportunity for players all over the country to come and make new friends, make lifelong relationships with their host families, develop their game, and, um, and really give us a great brand of baseball. And it's also been a place where 45 to 50 people every summer get part-time employment, many, most um, a first-time job and it's also been a boost to our economy through a lot of different local vendor partnerships so we want to see that come back in 2020 i know everybody does but we also want to make sure that it's safe to do so and if it's not then we'll we'll keep moving towards 2021 and we'll make sure that when baseball does come back to joe martin field it will be the best version of best bells baseball yet but again we are cautiously optimistic that there can be some sort of baseball played this summer and um, continue to have those conversations and will continue to have those conversations with our local health officials. Our front office is a, is a small but mighty staff of three and many of you have met us around the ballpark or gotten to know us, uh, myself, Nate Anderson and Ashley Ferns. We are all still working, everyone is still employed, and will continue to be. So um, if there is no season this summer, if there is a partial season, if there's any impact to play this summer, our, our full-time staff will continue to have jobs. And they're working so hard right now to support their sponsors, support local businesses, support our communities. And we're really trying to deploy all of our assets that we have to really supporting our community because we love this community and this community has really supported us over the years and we are so proud to be a part of this community and so um, in this time we are trying to do uh, whatever we can to be helpful to our community while we just kind of wait and see if this summer is going to yield itself to baseball and and if it doesn't we're committed to continuing to help our community and to plan for 2021 as we go forward I just want to say a quick heartfelt thank you to everyone in our entire community and the Bells family. Um, so many people working so hard right now to help our community during this trying time. People at Welcome Unified Command, people in our first responders, people in our medical sector, grocery, sanitation, um, all of those essential workers who are going to work every day for us and working so hard for our community. And then also just those in our community who are doing their part to slow the spread and are staying home. It's a hard thing to do. I know we're all ready to 
get out of our houses and uh, go watch baseball and do other things, but everyone's really doing their part um, to slow COVID-19. And um, I just think our community is, is so amazing. And I know we knew that already, but um, thank you to everyone for the part that you're playing to get our community through this trying time. So in the coming days and weeks, we'll update you. And as we know more, we'll let you know what the summer looks like and what the impact on our season will be. But as of right now, know that we're ready. Know that if it's safe to do so, we'll play. And if it's not safe to do so, or not deemed safe to do so by our local officials who, who we trust and appreciate so much, then, then the season may have to be canceled. But no decisions have been made and we will continue to update you as we get a little more information. As always, thank you for all the support that you've given us and go Belts.